Hello everybody, welcome back to the EAFC 24 Japan Road to Glory. So, uh, I haven't uploaded in a while, and for all likelihood, I am not going to complete champs this weekend, so sorry about that. Been too busy, and I already did champs for one of my accounts, so definitely not going to do that for the other one. But, in any case, I still made it so that I'll at least get some packs that'll be worth your while. So, if you don't know, Centurions is in packs right now. Uh, which gives us an ample opportunity to pack some good players. So we got ourselves a 78 times 2 uh, to open. Then we got a rare players pack, which is nice. Then we got ourselves an 85 times 2 rare gold players pack, which could be really good. We're about to see if that gives us anything good. And then we got ourselves the 86 times 3 rare gold players pack. We're gonna definitely take the pack here for fodder. Uh, and whatever fodder we do end up getting, we'll use it towards the hero player pack so we're gonna go ahead and check if there's anything else in milestones that we haven't acclaimed yet doesn't look that way cool oh there's a foundation thing ah, who cares not for a sniper nah, give me a break all right in any case we're gonna start with some big packs now and hopefully we can pack ourselves the centurions or at the very least get some good fodder for uh the spc for the hero spc so what do we got here first we got um Borja Iglesias I believe which is an 83 nothing crazy um and of course there are gonna be a lot of dupes in this video so keep that in mind next up the rare players pack 83 plus guaranteed no Centurion but we might get Robertson it is Robertson that's good good old Robertson we'll take it an 86 if I remember correctly yep uh Cuthbert good a nice little walkout. Oh no, my batteries are about to die. Um, yeah, they can they can survive for this pack opening. It's fine. All right. Uh, next up, we got the 85 times two pack. Can we pack ourselves a centurion here? Only one way to find out. No, we do not. That's unfortunate. Brazil though. CDM Casemiro, right? Yep, Casemiro. An 89. Not bad. We'll take the fodder that we can get, man. And good old fodder means some good opportunity for the packs to be opened. I don't even know if that was a sentence. Anyways, 86 times 3. This could be huge. This could be our best chance to pack a Centurions. Let's pack it open. Let's go. Okay, no Centurions, but... Hey, Kavada Shkelia. Alright, nice. We'll take a Kavada. Uh, this could be a double walkout. Well, it has to be. Who's the other one? Bruno Fernandez. Alright, an 88 and an 87. Or an 86, I mean, but... Uh, that's good fodder. Not gonna lie, good fodder. That's for the other player, uh, Tony Kroos. So, an 86 Cavada Scalia, an 86 Tony Kroos, and an 88 Bruno Fernandez. Alright, some good players right there. Um, alright, let's go ahead and, uh, let's check on our preview pack. Make sure that we're not missing out anything. Uh, Spain, center back, Laporte. No, that looks to be a neck. Is that a walkout? That is a walkout. That's Mapi Leon. That's an 89 rated Mapi Leon. You know what? I think I might actually buy this pack. How much is how much how much is she? For an 89. Wow. Look at that. That's profit. Hey, that's profit. I don't mind that too much. Yeah, I'll get the pack. I'll buy it. Why not? 7.5k for an 89 rated Mapi Leon? I will take it. Uh that's 30 something coins. We'll sell. We will sell. We will be there. Let's go for good old 35.75. There we go. Might be not too much, but also quick enough for it to be sold. All right. You know what? That's a good preview pack. That's a really good preview pack. The next one is going to be even better. Watch. Watch this preview pack. Um, nope. Unless, no. Uh, yeah. It's an 83. All right. Let's go ahead and craft that hero pack, and I'll be right back. Alrighty guys, we have completed the Max 87 Hero Pack. I almost splurt, I almost like uh, <laughs> flubbed it there. But yeah, we got the Max 87 Hero Player Pack upgrade. And uh, we're going to go ahead and open it right now. Now, the best hope we can get from this RTG is that we pack ourselves uh, Nakata. However, I wouldn't mind any other big uh, heroes like, you know, Marquisio or anything like that. Uh, the last time I packed, uh, I opened up this pack, uh, I ended up getting a Gilly, which was not bad. But, of course, you kind of hope that you end up getting one of the better ones as well. Not that it was bad. Hey, Furuhashi, nice of you. 
Uh, Furuhashi has an evolution, by the way. Really, really good. Not gonna lie. Really, really good. I've been enjoying his card. Oh, man. The evolution. Just wait till they bring up another evolution for that. It's gonna be insane. That's a... Wait, that's a... That's a silver, right? Yeah. Uh, you can kind of tell if, you, if the letters are gold and stuff like that. That's when I can tell if it's an icon or not. So don't get your hopes up. Anyways, max 87 base hero player. Uh, the best players we can get out of these is obviously Yaya Torre, Marquisio, uh, who else? Uh, Alawiren, uh, Cordoba. Plenty of options. But in this RTG, Hidetoshi Nakata would be the proper hero that we can pack uh, as well for this RTG. So. Let's open it and hope for the best. So here we go. Max 87. Who we got? Nigeria? Send it forward. Okay. JJ Okocha. Um, I don't know how to feel about this one. Uh, it's kind of a weird one. Uh, I mean, he's okay, but I don't think he's the best, to be honest. Oh, no. That's Kanu. Oh, what? Oh, so I got the worser one? Oh, I, I forgot. I, I forgot freaking... Uh, I forgot Okocha's a cam. So Kanu is definitely the worst one, I believe. Um, oh, great. The, the servers are down. But in the meantime, let me go ahead and check his price on Footy Bin. Uh, let's go to Foot Bin and check his price real quick. Kanu. I'm assuming he's like 80k. He's not going to be super expensive. Uh, and one Kokamu. He is... Oh, he's even worse. He's 17k. Oh, perfect. Oh, great. Thanks, EA. I wanted a player of that price, of that caliber. Three star, three star. Oh, yeah, no, no way. He's, he's He looks terrible. All right, while the servers get fixed up, let's go ahead and uh, skip ahead. Alrighty, guys, I lied. Um, So, <laughs> I probably shouldn't start off by saying that. But, yeah, I managed to complete Foot Champs. Um, I know I said in the last little snippet that I wasn't, but we're here on the next day, by the way. Um, I completed Foot Champs last night. And so... Yeah, we got foot champs rewards to open up as well. So along with that, we also got some new uh, objectives, some new SBCs, um, yada yada, all the sort. Now we got ourselves some in an interesting. Uh, I believe there's a new objective. I think. I I think. So we got some champs objectives. Obviously, we'll go ahead and claim those as well. Uh, we got ourselves uh, devolution mastery as well. We'll claim that as well. Two players eh, wouldn't hurt to get some packs. Um, but then there's the new, I think there's a new milestone, if I remember, if, yep, there it is, Centurion's Crafting Upgrade, now, this is very interesting because this provides us some good packs to try to complete while we're grinding for the next month, so, be on the lookout for that when we do and eventually get there, so, we got plenty of packs to open now, um, of course, these are all foot champs and a couple, a couple of the foot champs uh, qualification ones as well, so some tradable stuff. So we're going to go ahead and open all these up, but first, we got the player picks to go through. Afterwards, we'll play a couple games. I'm putting some more Japanese players through the evolution, some low rear, some low tiered um, silver players. So that uh, hopefully when a future evolution comes up, they'll be um, eligible for it. So, let's go for it. I'll discuss them in a sec. For first player pick, we get Odegaard. That's fine, a good old walkout. And then the next one, we got... Uh, another one, let's see here, we get Modric, nice. By the way, I finished rank 6, um, 9 wins. So we got ourselves a couple of uh, ultimate pack, uh, an ultimate pack and a rare players pack, yada yada. You know the whole spiel. So, uh, gold meaning customization, we'll just uh, pass this on. I thought they patched this already. I guess they reset it again by accident uh, during the last patch. So we have to go through the whole motions uh, for that, but we'll just, we'll just skip it ahead. All right. Now we're going to go into the actual packs. Um, afterwards, we'll play a couple games if we can. Um, and then we'll move it on from there. So let's see who we got here. Left mid, that's a silver. That's whatever. Uh, this land is great. All right. And then we got two rare gold players pack. Um, this one's uh, untradeable, obviously. Uh, hopefully we can pack a Centurions out of these, but I don't think that's going to be the case. Kimmich? Kimmich, okay. So we get Joshua Kimmich from this one. That's not bad. An 88 rated for um, for a two players pack, two rare golds. Not bad. Not gonna lie. Not bad. All right. So there's Lamela. We'll put him away. Nice and easy. All right. Now we're gonna move on to the bigger packs. Um, let's go for the tradable ones first. Small prime. 
Well, I mean, I think they're all uh, they're all tradable. I think so. Who knows? Uh, Grimaldo. Uh, nothing really crazy. Uh, an 84 rated. It's not too bad. Uh, we'll go ahead and put away all these. Uh, Mancini. All right. Next up, uh, rare gold packs. Two of them. Then a rare players, and then a and then an ultimate. Ho hopefully, we can pack ourselves. Oh, okay, I was thinking that was gonna be like center forward, but it's Rodrigo de Paul. Um, hopefully, we do end up packing the Centurions out of this. Lozano, two shadows, nice. Shadows are pretty expensive right now, right? Yep, they're practically extinct. Uh, we'll put them away from now. I believe I have a couple more shadows anyway, so it's fine. And good old Ito. Um, we'll just quick sell them, unfortunately, because I already have them. Untradeable. All right. Next up, we got the rare gold pack again. Hopefully, we get some more rare consumables, like another shadow, maybe, or a hunter. Uh, we get Chicago Red Star center back. She is, um, she's probably like an 82, so nothing crazy there. Uh, catalyst, so nothing there. All right, cool. So let's put these two away. And now we're going to move on to the bigger packs, the rare players pack and the ultimate pack and the 85 plus. So let's go with the rare players pack first. See if we end up getting a walk out of this one. Argentina goalkeeper, Debo. It's going to be freaking um, Emmy, Emmy Martinez and Bono. Two of these guys, uh, as, of cr as of recording right now, they've already been placed in the Ballon d'Or. Um, in the Ballon d'Or top 15. So congratulations on them. Uh, but yeah, two, two goalkeepers worthy of the top 15. There we go. But they're both 85, so no all right next up we got the ultimate pack uh let's see no special but we do get holland please no it's gonna be freaking um i forgot her name uh hedgerberg right her card was glitched i think early in the early stages of the game but it's been fixed now but an 89 is not bad an 89 is not bad but that's pretty much the extent of it the rest of it is just coins which we'll take. We will take the coins. Finally, we got ourselves the 85 plus. Can we pack a Centurions? One way to find out. Wait, that's a... That, oh, that's a Centurions. There we go. Wait, English center back from Brighton. All right. You know what? That's pretty good. The fact that we get Dunk, that means we can actually put him into the Centurions upgrade. If you don't know, uh, EA gave us a Centurions upgrade. Uh, he is tradable. He's about 30k, I think. Or even more than that, he's like 40k. But I will now sell him uh, for the sole purpose because, um, yeah, EA have given us uh, another, another evolution, which is the Centurion's upgrade. And Lewis Dunks completely, completely qualifies for that. So with his upgrade, if he goes to plus two, he'll get an 81 pace upgrade with the 88 defending and 86 physical. Um, he's gonna be really good on his upgrade. So yeah, I actually, I'm actually pretty happy about that because his, his up, he kind of does need a bit of the upgrade to make him good. So we'll go ahead and put him in. He'll be untradeable, and he provides a good link to um to my Kaoru Mitoma as well. So that shouldn't be an issue. So Lewis Dunk. Uh, wait, was it Lewis Dunk? I don't remember. And these are the ones I'm talking about. These are the Trailblazer upgrades I'm talking about. So I'm putting um, Ogawa into the Trailblazer Slide Tackler. It's not going to be have a big upgrade per se, but I think it'll be good enough for when another one comes in. He'll probably be pretty good. I mean, his physicals are pretty good. Just the aggression is low, but defending and everything else is pretty much uh, needs work. The pace is fine. So the only thing that really needs working is his dribbling and defending. So hopefully we'll get to we'll get some future evolutions to work that up. But in the meantime, I'm gonna work with this. As for the center back, we got this one, uh, Kobayashi, which um, again, some of those key stats are gonna need work. But hopefully by the time we finish this, he'll become a better defender. With 80 strength, he'll have plenty to work with. 75 defending, plenty to work with. Uh, of course, he's gonna need upgrades in composure and yada yada, but. We'll get those working sooner or later. Now, uh, the next upgrade that I'm going to try to focus on if I can, and once I can afford it, or I mean, I guess I can't afford it but here, but uh, I'm going to try to put Morita into this uh, this one right here, the Trouble is your Interceptor. Um, and the reason why is because, again, uh, as an 86, 
with uh, intercept, which is fine. Um, he's a pretty good defender. 95 interceptions. Uh, stand tackle is pretty good. Dribbling is okay. Passing and long passing are okay as well. But I definitely do need another midfield presence within my squad as well, who's Japanese. Because Hasegawa, as good as she is, uh, her physicals are literally the biggest problem with the, with um, that midfield. So I'll be working towards uh, upgrading Morita as well. So I got plenty of playstyles to work with. Um, I might have to unlock this pretty soon because it unlocks within a day. So I might have to unlock it either today or some other day. So I'll work on that. But yeah. In any case, um, as for the other players, I don't think I have enough uh, players here. I have Wanky Chan actually for this one. Which would be very interesting because Wanky Chan is probably one of the best evolutions you could get for this. Is he tradable? I actually gotta check real quick because if he is tradable, he actually does cost. He actually is like pretty expensive right now in the market. So let me check. He is untradable. All right, fair enough. He's untradable, which is fine. Uh, if there's no other bigger upgrades that I can use for this, I will use Huang Chan as my evolution for this one. So we'll just keep that in mind. This is the squad I ran for foot champs. Um, I mean, of course, it's, it's pretty tough to try to run a backline with this, but hopefully with the upgrades, it'll be better. And again, like I mentioned with Morita, she has great dribbling, stuff like that. But the strength is literally the biggest thing that kills her within that midfield. Uh, as good as defending as she has, or, you know, as good as defending she is, it's really difficult to try to win a lot of those balls physically if um, she doesn't have enough of the strength. So, uh, we'll try to, we'll, we'll still keep running with her for the meantime, but until then, Morita will have to be the one replacement for her. Um, Yorente was pretty good. Uh, Furuhashi, uh, still really good for me. Good pace and stuff like that with the Hunter. He's really fast. Ueda, by the way, I finished Ueda's evolution, and my goodness, he is a monster, by the way. So, um, his upgrades literally helped me win the last couple of games of Foot Champs once he got finally evolved fully. His finishing is amazing, by the way. His finishing is great. Um, yeah, of course, the only problem would be a bit of his dribbling, yada yada, but I think for me, that's uh, kind of irrelevant when he's just running through. I mean, he's six foot two, so he has plenty of room to, you know, he's just six foot. But he has plenty of room to just like, you know, beat people on the, just to defeat people on the run. And with 99 jumping, his headers are actually pretty good. So, really good player. I'm glad I crafted him. Uh, Mitoma, there he is. For Dunk, let me see where he fits in that system then, if that's the case. Uh, let's see here. Let's go for center back. Uh, well, set it low to high. There it is. Dunk. That'd be good there. Uh, wow, we actually lost a lot of Kim. Probably because of the Japanese players, right? But it's fine. Uh, Mitoma's fine there. Um, Morita will probably be in that same boat, but we'll try our best. Uh, let's look at here. Jap Japanese players here. We still got Kamada. Uh, we still got Endo and Morita. I believe Endo doesn't qualify for the Treble as an interceptor. But Morita does, so we'll look, we'll look into him. And yeah, that provides the the Japanese links. So there we go. This is pretty much the squad I'll be running for a little while, at least until I get some better upgrades. Dunk definitely needs some upgrades um, or some links at the very least. So maybe Kyle Walker. This is where he comes in. The problem with Sugawada though is that he cannot play left back. So if we change him here. It gives Dunk and Kyle Walker full camp, but Sugawada is going to have to take a backseat, I suppose. I mean, it still goes for the top, like, you know, minimum three Japanese players, but we'll have to work that. We'll have to workshop that somehow. All right. Well, in any case, uh, let's try these out with a new, with a new game and uh, let's see where we go from there. Let's try it. Alrighty, guys, we have our first game and it looks like he's evolving Matip. He already evolved Darwin to a full extent. He has a pretty good squad. We're playing in some grassroots um, football here, so let's just enjoy it. Morita. Okay, you can move a little bit. Itakura. Nice. Kyogo. And then Ueda. Nice. There we go. Ooh. Bang. 1-0. Ueda is still really good, man. So good. Is he onside? Looks like he is. Give it to Ueda, baby. Bang. Oh, what a finish. Right on the post. And in. And pass it down the middle. There's Furuhashi, baby. Let's go. Whoop. And nice. 
Nice little flick. And we're three up. Kubo again. Furuhashi. Uh, finish that. Yeah. Four nil. Let's go. Furuhashi got himself on the board. Good. Good passing. Nice. Beautiful. Amazing. Oh, there we go. Good physical. Ayaz is pretty good physically too. So that's what helps. Up, oh, rushed it. Well, that's mine to score. Boop. And goal. <laughs> and he's done. Finally, it's about time. All right, that's one game done. Let's move on to the next one. All right, next game. This is what the squad is looking like for him. Slightly worse than the last guy, but Cascadino might be an issue with that quick step. We'll have to see how it goes. Here we go. Guess we'll just manage. Whoop. There we go. Furuhashi on the run. Let's go. Run it. Bang. Ah. Uh. That super extension. Boop. No matter the goalkeeper, they can't resist this chip. They can't resist the chip shot. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. This could be bad. I'm messing up. Oh, I'm messing up too much times. Okay, well. That was on me. I messed up too many times on trying to stop him. And I keep mistiming it. But we'll try our best to get it back. Need to open up a bit. There we go. Kyle Walker. Good. Ayase. Please find the cutback. Yeah! There we go. Furuhashi. What a goal. To go Kubo. Nice. Good. Good. Kubo on the run. Let's go. There we go. Ayase. Nice. There we go. Ueda. Bang. 3-1. Uh, My bad. But Ueda on the run. You got to get that, bro. There we go. Good work, Itakura. Oh, come on, Walker. Just get it. Ah. Oh, whoa, jeez. Oh, okay. Well, that's an interesting way to look on that. Fair enough. Cannot let him score. Oh, this could be bad. Give me that. All right. Well, let's going to end this game in a draw, unfortunately. We were winning, but... It seems it was not meant to be. Or at least I hope it's still not... Oh, no. Just don't don't let him score. There we go. Just get it out. All right. Let's just go. All right. 3-3. Three, three. Uh, we'll try for one more game if we can. Uh, let's see what we do. Alrighty guys. Last game we're going to be playing. And this one might be a toughie. With Diani, Alawiren, and Swanson at the front. This might be terrible for me. But we'll figure it out. Let's see how well we do. I need someone to open up. There we go. Good. Takafusa Kubo. Come on, Hasegawa. Ah, damn. Oh, this could be bad. Oh, this is real bad. And, ah. There it is. There it is. All right, man. We're going to have to fight it out with our hardest. The hardest we can. Ah, uh, well, yeah, it's going to be pretty bad for us. It's going to be really bad for us. Hasegawa. Hasegawa. Whoa, Hasegawa, look at that. The pace. Chip shot. Hey, look at that, Hasegawa. Let's go. Man, she made that look easy. There we go. Furahashi. We drew it up again. Let's go. Go, go, go. Furahashi, please. Oh, that's a foul, yep. And I'm his last man, so it should be a red card, I hope. Please give him a red card. Yes, red card, let's go, last man. Offsides, nope. Not that time. Come on, Roya. Oh, he scored. Alright, we gotta get this back. Come on, come on, we gotta get this back. Oh, no. Okay, well, I'm, I'm letting this get out of hand, so... Let's try to get it back. Come on. Just relax. Give me that. Nice, Ryoya. This could be good. Pass it out. Furuhashi, baby. Oh, come on. There we go. Furuhashi. Good. We're getting back in this. Let's go. Pick them out. There we go. Good. There we go, Ayase. Boom. Let's go. We're Drew. We're John. Let's go. Give me that. Give me that. Yes, Asagawa. Let's go. All right, here we go. Here we go. This could be good. Good counter. Nice. To Kubo. Kubo can take it all the way. All the way! Let's go, Kubo! 
Nice little chip shot. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh no. Ooh. Okay. Fair enough. Oh, gotta get out of here. Damn it. Ah. God is so irritated, man. Just when you think you're so close, everything falls on you. This could be ours. Oh, there we go. There we go. Two minutes. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go, Weta. I evolved you for a reason. Here we go. Yes. Morita! Ah. Oh, no. That was to win the game. Please, someone get to this header. Dunk. Ah, damn it. Well, that's our loss, guys. Well, with that being said, guys, if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. I'll catch you all next time on the next episode of the RTG. See ya.